My name is Dr Peter Cull. I'm the director of ICT International. Along with Susan Cull, we run this niche business in Armidale in northern New South Wales. ICT International develops and manufactures through an extensive R&D program instrumentation to measure plant water use, soil moisture and the environment. The instruments are exported to more than 50 countries in the world. In order that this business operate, we need to access highly skilled people, typically electronic engineers, microprocessor engineers and service people. We have been able to do this through the 489 visa program. This visa program has been absolutely critical to the further growth and development of our business because we've been able to access the skills we need to enable us to continue going forward and developing our export market. Hi, my name is Vung Ba Jung and I'm studying electrical electronic engineer in Queensland University of Technology. After graduated, I went to Sydney to looking for a job and I come across with the 489 visa option and it's allowed me to explore more about Australia. I took a chance to apply for the 489 visa and came to Armida. In the first, during first few weeks, I start working in tomato farms and during that work, I still looking for my professional career. I went to the job website and see the ICT International has the position as the electronic engineer. I applied for that job and um, Peter and Susan who is the owner of the business interviewed me and gave me a chance to be in that position. I feel really lucky because this will be my start point of my professional career. I work here for one and a half year until now and it's a wonderful place. I met a lot of wonderful people. I love Armidale City. It's nice and peaceful and it's turned out the regional visa has worked well for me. Hi, my name is David Makasheb. I'm originally from the Philippines and I worked there as a process engineer and moved to Singapore and practice the same field before moving here in Australia. Me and my wife came here in Australia handling a skilled provision 489 visa and we're looking for a better lifestyle here in, in the long term. I'm very thankful to Mr. Gary Fry of Ardani for nominating us in the Northern Tableland region of New South Wales and also for including us in the skilled migration job board group in Facebook. I find this group to be very helpful in searching for an employment, as well as getting helpful information about the region. When we received the visa, we started looking for a job here in the region. And luckily I found this spot in ICT International. My wife, who used to work in a childcare center in Singapore, was able to find a job in the same field here in Armidale. We find Armidale as a lovely place. It is peaceful and quiet. The basic things you need is available, no traffic jam. It has a fabulous cathedral church, some great pubs and coffee shops, and also lovely and friendly people. I've started working in ICT International as an electronic engineer field technician doing some repairing and servicing of ICT instruments. There are times that I also help at the dispatch area working on some critical customer orders for shipments. After a while I was given a project to work on and that will help grow the, the business in the future. So I've been helping out the company do some organizing and establishing a system. Currently I work as a process engineer and my main task is to improve the key processes of the business that is relevant to the quality management system that we are establishing. And I'm so glad to impart my knowledge and skills that I have gained from my past work experience in semiconductor industry for 19 years. 
I find that this company has a lot of potential to grow further because of the excellent product that they have developed. Having said that, I would like to express my sincere gratitude to Susan and Dr. Peter Call for giving me an opportunity to be a part of this organization. And also I would like to thank my fellow colleagues for their support and kind throughout the year. Thank you very much. Thank you.